So I mentioned hot topics. Yankees fan would love to have the hot topic be Masahiro Tanaka in pinstripes. But as far as that story goes, Jack, it's a very low simmer right now. Be patient, Bob, with Tanaka. It's going to heat up. It's going to percolate soon. It just hasn't happened yet. Casey Close, Tanaka's agent, was on vacation with his family. So he's the man who was going to spirit any negotiations that happen, whether it's with the Yankees or another team. And they will happen soon. The Yankees are very interested in this pitcher. But, of course, they're not the only team that is interested in Tanaka. We're in that lull right now, right after the new year, where things haven't really started to kick in yet. But this guy is the biggest story in baseball right now, a guy who's never thrown a pitch in the major leagues, but who lots of teams would like to have him throw his first pitch for them. And we're not going to get resolution probably for a couple weeks now if the posting system were the old posting system Dave we might know by now but it's not so the rules have changed yeah it's kind of interesting I, I think if they hadn't changed the posting system this might have been resolved in November okay and he would have been slotted in there with a myriad of other other free agents okay but the way it's happened now, he is now, as Jack said, he's this marquee guy. And the, the, because of the change in the system, his contract's going to be so much bigger. I, I'm starting to wonder if he's, you know, it's a, it's a little bit of a risky proposal now because if it's going to be more than $100 million, it's, it's, it's we don't know what he's going to do. See, I agree with you. I think something interesting has happened here. It's a little bit like the NFL draft when people start saying, my team has to draft this guy, who I've never seen play, by the way, you know, to because we can't win without this guy I've never seen play, right? <laughs> it's like, the Yankees must sign this guy, right? Have you ever seen him lift his arm? No. Do you think it will translate here? I don't know. But there's this fervor now. It's almost like the mystery works to his advantage. Right. With everything that's wrong with Jabaldo Jimenez, Matt Garza, Irvin Santana, Bronson Arroyo, we know those guys can pitch in the major leagues. I'm a, we assume this guy can. If we trust scouts, he can. But you know, Daisuke Matsuzaka, not too long ago, we heard was going to be great, great, great. I guess he was great, great, great for about a year and a half. So let's see what actually ends up happening here. Well, it's funny you mentioned Daisuke because at the time when the Red Sox were getting Daisuke, was also Keigawa was was the Yankees were getting him at the same time, and we all know how that turned out. I mean, Igawa, whatever Matsuzaka was, Igawa was a disaster. But right at the point when the Red Sox were in Japan to sign Matsuzaka and, and consummate the deal, you know, they heard the Yankees were going after Igawa, and they said to a, a major league official, did we get the wrong guy? Because they were worried that, you know, the, if the Yankees are going after Igawa, maybe it's him. And they're like, did we get the wrong guy? They were, they were nervous. That, right? that shows you right there how much of a mystery it is, as Joel said. Yep. But here's the thing. The Yankees had eight scouts watch this guy. They trust their scouts. They pay these guys to bring back reports that tell them this guy can pitch in the major leagues tomorrow. So they are entrusting their scouts to take those numbers, and he's not going to go 24-0 when he gets to the major leagues. But will he be a competent top-of-the-rotation pitcher? From the scouts I've spoken to, from the people I've spoken to, they say yes, but we don't know until that day happens. And by the way, our Japanese reporter friends, they're always very interested in interviewing us. So before the posting process got changed, one of them said to me, what do you think he'll sign for? I said, oh, Darvish money. I'll say 60 million for six years. So in a Japanese newspaper, I'm going to look very stupid because he's going to get more than 60 million. <laughs> you know, he is now, absolutely. I wonder if some of those eight Yankee scouts were the same guys who were on Agawa and said that he can't <laughs> miss as a back Or was it starter. eight or was it just Mike Pagliarulo for Agawa? Was it Mike Pagliarulo? <laughs> yeah. Uh, so I think the number's interesting where it goes because this is going to be a big investment and if this is a disaster, it's going to be starting with a one is in 100 million plus because I think you have to say that Darvish, his post was 57.1 million. He got 60. 